students hope you are good today we are going to discuss about html concepts okay before you going to start uh, let me tell you about a uh, few things <clears throat> actually this is a starting we can say starting of web starting of web designing okay so basically html uh helps you a lot okay it is used to build static page it's a markup type of language so html stands for hypertext markup language okay let me scroll what is html okay yes it is a markup type of language which is introduced by dr tim berners lee okay sir tim berners lee introduced this markup language in 1991 but published in 1995 okay html is used to build static web pages or websites okay it is just a um, designing type of language markup type of language okay why it is called as markup which we but because which include tag behavior okay there are different types of tags so that's why it's called as a markup type of language okay next slide yes how html code is created this is very interesting it's not a, a programming language okay it is related to the markup type of language okay you can develop source code okay so using tags and um, their behaviors you can build html code okay there are i already told you there are different type of tags okay you can use attribute as well in particular tag any html tag is delimited within the opening and closing angular brackets that is <clears throat> less than sign and greater than sign okay these are called as angular brackets okay so because of this angular bracket web browser can easily interpret okay web browser can easily print uh, actual output right so now extension you know uh, in computing in compute on computer there are different type of extensions right dot html or dot htm extension is used to save html document right either dot html or dot htm how to uh, save file just use control plus s or click on uh, file menu and select save option you need first of all you need one proper file name for example first dot html or we can say uh, index dot html so in this way you can enter proper file name and then extension for example index dot index is a file name dot html is extension okay dot html or dot htm okay now next <clears throat> now interesting part is this software requirements let me show you exactly yes software requirements so text editor is required and web browser which type of text editor there are different types of text editor available on <coughs> uh, laptop desktop as well as on portable devices like mobile phone also okay 
uh, examples text edit examples like uh, which is on desktop or laptop that is um, notepad notepad plus plus dreamweaver then atom okay sublime text so these are various examples um, some uh, text editor are in built in your OS okay and uh, on mobile phone there are different type of apps which is comes under text editor category uh, very popular uh, one text editor is an writer a n w r i t e r in case you want um, such type of uh, implement your html code <clears throat> then you can i highly recommend to use um, so any type of text editor okay if you want to work on mobile if you want to practice on mobile then you can go through an writer text editor okay now next thing is web browser is also required i already told you about different type of there are different type of web browsers um category different type of web browser names web browser names like uh, google chrome mozilla firefox internet explorer microsoft edge safari okay so these are um different types of browser names okay actually browser is used or uh, browser is execute uh, html page browser is used to execute html documents okay so this is about this is about software requirements now next part is basic structure let me show you basic structure this is basic structure <coughs> in html i already told you about this is there are lots of tag behavior there are different type of tags and its attributes html tags are keywords okay these are reserved words means you need to enter specific characters within angular brackets okay so tags are not so tags are not case sensitive okay now here case sensitivity means um, you can able to enter sm small letters or capital letters okay so in this way you can uh, type tag behavior right there is no any type of case sensitivity okay every page includes within two tags okay opening and closing this is a opening html and this is close html okay how to identify just um, opening tag without angular bracket without slash forward slash and closing tag with forward slash okay the next point is this page is divided into two sections internally head section and body section <clears throat> okay there is a fixed structure okay uh, means we can say first is html second is i will show you exactly what I'm going to telling you this is about HTML structure okay this is basic structure of HTML document opening HTML tag the next opening head tag okay inside head section there is a title opening title tag title goes there okay means uh, in dot 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 means title goes then title tag close after that head section close means head tag close body section start means body tag start opening body tag or starting body tag then body content goes here <coughs> right 
dot 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 means body content actual body content or we can say actual web page display area then body tag clothes and HTML clothes <coughs> so this is about basic HTML structure okay in this way you can write your HTML code okay <clears throat> hope you understand uh, this basic structure okay I will show you uh, I have and writer application okay just a minute okay so this is and writer application okay in this way you can able to uh, type HTML okay <clears throat> HTML markup type of language this is very easy to enter code HTML source code don't worry this is uh, um, 12th HTML code but I am just I just want to show you how to write structure okay see there are um, closing type of tag body tag close HTML close I also show you about oh, HTML open head open title tag name of title tour website title tag close then uh, head tag close body tag open and these are body content and water tag close and HTML close. So this is about <coughs> uh, how to write inside uh, and writer application. Okay. Okay. So in this way, you can able to write HTML document. Okay. Now one more concept is attribute concept. Okay. Attribute means it defines a property for an element consists of an attribute or value and appears within the element starting tag element start tag attribute is a uh, one type of we can say one type of keyword which is placed inside opening tag always opening always in opening tag okay sometimes we need additional information with a tag okay so this is about attribute concept okay and next part classification of HTML tags we're going to discuss into next lecture okay thank you